Greetings, minions, mech warriors, and fellow gamers. This is Silverblade playing Battletech, episode 96. Uh, last week, uh, we did some things and blew up some, some things, and and all was good. <laughs> uh, we, I, if I recall right, we got all the upgrades for the Argo, so all that is good. So now it's just, uh, let's see. Yeah, it's just uh, doing contracts. So let's get into a new contract. Now eventually uh, we'll do this. But for now, we'll do uh, missions, kind of build up some money, and all that good stuff. Um... Ooh, what's this? Assassinate. Torians. Ooh, okay. It's a four and a half skull mission. We can undertake that. Emphasis on the undertake. <laughs> and. Uh, we'll, we'll go for the six salvage. Probably not gonna get anything really good, but then, well, you know, it is a four skull, four, four and a half skull mission. Let's just go for it. What do we got to lose? Um. Okay, this is the AC-10. Where's Murderbot? There's Murderbot. Um. Oh, it's that one that does only 60 tons. That's bullshit. That's bullshit. Okay, um, let's see, 19, and let's see, four skull, recovery, polar. And there we go. So, yeah, they're all in the right spot. I don't want to do a, a limited mission. It just, why? When you already have five, six, seven assault mechs, why go backwards? <laughs> there has to be a significant reward for you to go backwards, you know? Anyway. So we got some recovery to do. Um, yeah, this is a pretty standard mission. Don't know if it's going to be a standard map, though. We'll get her done. Yeah. Silver Blades Marauders just don't extract. We stick around until everything's dead. <laughs> okay, so I'm thinking... Running up to this ridge... Hold the Cyclops back. Oh, I think I know what's going on here. Okay, so what I'm going to do... We'll hold the ridge... And have Silverblade run up. Well, actually, no. We'll have the Cyclops run up and actually capture the base because she's this guy or uh, Behemoth has the. Uh, wait, does he? Does she? Derp, derp. Um. Oh, it's got the, just the battle computer. It can move fast. It. Sh I was thinking it might have the extended range to detect. Uh, contacts, but it don't matter that she don't. Aye, aye. Now it matters. Got an unknown Can I get all three? And only from there. 
Okay, now we enter the combat phase. Let's see what we got here. We got a cataphract, a shri yeah, that one's got to go, and then demolisher. All right, so what's my attack range here? This is the and they're in range. Let's let's take out the Shrek first. They go bye bye. Demolisher. That is tough as nails. Okay. All right, we'll get get her out of here. She's more or less a support mech. Not so much as a frontline combatant. And for some reason. Oh, I had the line of sight because of her. Dang damn it. Alright, well. That'll force him to come in. Stabilizing. Engaging coolant system. Alright, we've got an 8 ton mech on the field. And I'm gonna sensor lock this guy. I've got a sensor lock. Damn right you do. All right, let's fire again. A little bit of obstructive view, but let's go for it. There we go. Did not want that thing hitting me. Cataphract doesn't scare me, but marsupials do, because they're fast, and they dart. <laughs> Bonus points if you can, uh, <laughs> if you get the reference. It's quite obscure. Alright, we're gonna go head hunting. We'll hit everything but the head. Oh man. Oh, a victor. Okay. Not very impressive with the shots there. <laughs> Splody head. You figure you're firing six times, you're gonna hit whatever you wanted to at least once. And if you hit once, it'll be devastating. There we go, two headshots. Okay, now I can move in with Behemoth. Okay, that's a spot, Commander. Okay, so we'll brace. The asset has been secured and is ready for retrieval. Oh, that's it? Huh. I thought there'd be reinforcements, which is why I was holding back. It's all good to me. I'll be getting at least uh, two mechs out of the deal. Well, maybe not. <laughs> Well, no, actually I can. I can get the Cataphract for this and the Victor for that. Uh, AC 20 plus uh, plus. Comm system. Looks like that's about it. So we got an extra part for the Cataphract. Uh, we did get the uh, AC 10 and the AC 20 plus plus. Okay, not too shabby. 
mean, 15 million in value, but of course we would not get 15 million in C bills from that. Bummer, dude. Okay. Franken mech. All right, let's go to McBay, and we'll drop the cataphract into storage. Let's see, one ballistic, five laser, to support. Not bad. Not the greatest either. Okay, that one could be kind of beasty. But I think the I think one of the things I read was the armor or the speed was lacking. One of the two. Either way, it's not any of the ones that I'm using, so we roll with that. Alright, let's go on to the next contract. Alright, so this one Torrance, destroy base. Uh, this one it's a battle directorate. And assassinate. Now I wonder. I think it was the territorial. No, it wasn't that. Let's see. Um, I like that. Okay, there's no limit on weight there. I was thinking it was this one, but it might be. Might be this one, maybe. No, that's not it. Let's see. This one might be it. Yeah. Okay, so we can't do false security, but we can do these others. Um, this one pays the most. It's probably a much more drawn out battle here, but um, wow, they didn't do anything at all. It's just three extra that we can't pick, so. We'll go for it. So this is uh, Battle Polar Four and a Half Skull. Rock and roll. Man, that first mission was too easy. That really wasn't uh, worthy of a Four and a Half Skull or Four Skull mission. It should have been uh, Two Skull. <laughs> But thankfully, it didn't have a uh, weight limit in, in uh, drop weight. All right. Command interface initiated. Okay, so enemy units are there. There's a bit of a valley. Oh, okay, I know this map. You have a space down in here, a little bit of cover up in, in around this. This is all valley, and you have another peak here, so you, you'll have a blind spot back here if you're holding up here. You could theoretically have mechs come down through here, of course up through there, but that's not been in my experience in the past. So we'll get up here and we'll have the uh, Cyclops draw them out so we'll get our units in position Let's see, do I want to go that way or that way? Uh, go around this way. Okay, we... Alright, so we got... That's uh, like the Banshee. Maybe another Banshee. Uh, 60 tons, so... Interesting. Okay, so we don't have any cover, but that does not worry me. And we're 
probably going to have to sh shift position in here based on uh, these guys where they move in. Okay, so we got... Yeah. Alright, I need to get her pulled back. She's kind of my command and control and also um, recon. And support fire at that. So she's kind of the, uh, the jack of all trades, but not the master of murder. Alright, we'll reserve. What have we got in here? Let's say 90... 80, okay. Okay, they're gonna start approaching us here, so we just have the uh, height advantage, and they have the uh, brown pants advantage. <laughs> Ooh, and awesome, okay. Banshee, that's what I called. That's what I called. Alright, so... Okay. Alright, so this... I can only see him. Okay, then. So we just... Team up on this guy. Wow, I missed the shot. That's interesting. All right. So he's got one injury, and then the knockdown gives him two. But he'll probably take like four or five injuries before he actually dies or is incapacitated. Got the head, didn't get the center torso. It's just, that's a uh, that's a whole mech right there. So now we can change targets and not worry about the dragon, but the PPCs. I am a little bit leery of, so we'll we'll go take him out or try. Yeah, kind of counted on that. Uh, let's see. Back it up a little bit. And go for the head. Hmm. Behemoth. Uh, huh. All right, yeah, we can get up here and angle a shot on the dragon. It wasn't much, but it was worth it. Okay, there's the other banshee. Here comes the PPCs. Alright, there's two hits and a miss. Yes, Commander. Okay. So if I went for that out, you know what? We'll go for the ban the uh, awesome. Look at me when I'm shooting at you. There we go. So that's two full mechs, or at least should be two full mechs. OK, 
Okay, that was rude. Let's see. Oh, uh, the LRM-10, or the uh, AC-5, that's what it was. Yeah, I wonder where I'm going to shoot at. <laughs> Man, he's just not nailing those headshots. We're soaking up a lot of damage here. Okay, we will keep working this guy over. And there's not a, a chance that I can knock him down. But I can soften him up real good. And this guy here, I'm not really worried about him. But at the same end, he needs to be gone. So while the big guys are focusing down on the Banshee, uh, she'll just have her fun with this guy. Not a whole lot came of that. She can afford to soak up some damage. These guys, though, don't really need the uh, stray shots, though. Okay, Decker. Uh, hmm. All right, let's go for that face and a knockdown. All right, got the head. Now we focus down on the dragon. And we'll draw in the reinforcements. Alright, you gotta get the headshot there, dude. No. Probably gonna center torso him. Getting a little bit thin there. Well, let's see, actually, if I move. Yeah, being a Kind of a bad spot, so let's. Uh, let's see, what do I want her? Oh. Put her back here. Embrace. Oof. Okay, so that's my right torso, so I have to. Eh, okay. Stable ground there. Okay, we'll try it. That's an injury and a knockdown. Okay, bring on the next turn. I don't need precision strike. Let's either core him or face him. It's fine. So now the reinforcements have to come to me instead of relying on the line of sight from that guy. And I don't know where the reinforcements are at, but I would imagine they're somewhere out in here. Thinking, taking to the next ridge. Uh huh. 90, 85. 
9590 that is all the fixings for a whooping I think I'm gonna keep keep down on this ridge here. No point in me uh, sticking my neck out there. Oh come on! I wanted to get the the cover of this here, but maybe not. And yeah, we'll just race. Reserve again. Let's see if we can get these guys into the line of sight. Okay, there's the Cyclops. Okay, give me a turn. Uh, Banshee. Ooh, okay. Can't stay there very long. Come on, man. All right. So right side is pretty wanked. So go there, and we'll try to headshot the Cyclops. Of course, we miss all three shots. That's why Decker is the MVP. And if he misses. The Cyclops, it'll splash over on the Banshee, so that works. <laughs> okay, so we're obstructed. There we go. These headshots are just glorious. And we'll just have her brace. And now there's two mechs out here. I need to die. So there's this guy, and there's one out here somewhere in the shadows. Cause I yeah, because there's, there's just these two that I killed, so... Yeah, there he is. Ninety, eighty-five. Okay, we'll reserve. See if we can get him to come in closer. That's close enough, buddy. Okay, my annihilator is getting a little bit thin on the armor. Let's see if I come in here, I can isolate. That guy. Let's see. I should have all the chances in the world to, to get the uh, headshot. Of course, missed. Well, not really missed, but didn't get what I want. What is that up there? And that looks like a Highlander? Yep, that's a P variant. There we go. Another headshot. So now Decker is 
he's going to be in the MVP in this one. If you can nail this shot. <laughs> Perfect. Close that one up real good. Ah, that was nice. And so many mechs to choose from here. Let's see, there's Awesome, there's a Banshee, there's the other Banshee. Um, actually, there's three Banshees. So one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, one of them... All right, we got all three of this, so that's that's one mech. Huh. Either we got a headshot on the... Oh, this must have been... Let's see, one, two... Or one, two, three, and then there's a horse. That must have been the one that was on the ground that I blasted his head off. But all the rest, ex with the exclusion of uh, the dragon, decent headshots. Let's see. That's some good medium lasers. All right, PPC. Holy Jesus. A lot of stuff. I only get 12 extras, so I guess I have to pick really well here and since uh let's see i got one already of that but nothing else and banshee's heaviest and that usually means better resell but I don't know, remember if I had the Banshee E or the Banshee S. So we're just going to go with the S. And it's 12 million C bills. Alright, so we got the S and then we got the one part of the Stalker. And crap, crap all of the rest. Not the best pickings, but... Anytime you can come home with a full mech, uh, especially an assault, a full assault mech, yeah, it's a good day. Especially if you can get most of them in headshots. Uh, complete roster, okay. Uh, you guys can't see it on um, my uh, my video, but because it didn't capture Steam overlays, but I got an achievement for that. <laughs> All right. So we're in the mech bay, and we'll dump him off. Well, let's see. Uh, yo. All right. All right, that'll be it for this episode. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. And until the next time, see you later, Twitch. Twitch.